to cook with Bastian and today we're gonna make turnip soup or I like to call it solfis navos. So let's see the ingredients. So eight slices eight slices nitrate free bacon, two garlic cloves, five turnips, shredded parmesan, saffron, one fourth of a onion, four carrots, and salt and pepper to taste. First we're gonna peel the carrots. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna peel and you're gonna cut? Yes. Okay. So let's get started on this one. <laughs> I can help you to cut the carrot into half and then you can try I don't to cut need it. help. You don't need help, are you sure? Yes, I'm a knife expert. Yes, a... You're a knife expert? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me just cut this bit mm -hmm. from here and then Okay, I'm leaving it to you, knife expert. <laughs> How are you getting on? Good. Here are the two pieces. Mm -hmm. Cut. Perfect. Cut. Do you know how to cut it into smaller pieces? Yes, I do. Okay, what I can do for you is I'll do this look, like that. And now you need to just cut it into small pieces. Yes, like I understand. Okay, I'm so a knife expert. I'm perfect. A knife. So now you can do that. You can do it together or you can do it one at a time. This side, okay? Good job. Oh. You can try to make it a bit smaller. Oh yeah. Okay. This is how I'm cutting, see? Mm -hmm. This is how it is. Carrots are quite hard. They're not really too hard, but they they are an impo they hard but not impossible. They okay. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Good job. So your carrots. Now I, let me just cut these into small pieces for you. So. Oh. Okay. Yeah. And then you need to cut them. I understand. Okay, I'll prepare this for you. Yeah. I'm a knife expert. Cut. Can you see a bit more? Okay. There you go. So do the cutting. I'm now going to peel turnips. I find it actually quite easy to cut the carrot. Okay. Not too hard. Oops. First turnip is here. First turnip. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the Tori needs <laughs> the Navos. That's how you say turnip in Spanish, actually. Navos. Navos, 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 Navos. And how do you say turnip soup? Sopa de Navos. Mm -hmm. We're actually finding it quite easy to cut these t carrots. Okay, good job. Just impale. Just if you, you can, if you do it fast, it's easier. Second one. Got the 
this one. Third turnip. Yeah, I've got two more. Oops, what's that? It's the root. The cutting of these of the carrot is actually quite fast it's for me now okay yeah just a few more carrots yeah left how many there's still quite a few carrots left mm-hmm let me count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven carrots. Okay. Cut. Let me put the carrots away that I've already cut, so I'm not going to cut, accidentally cut a bit more of those. Mm -hmm. those. So let's move these carrots here. So now I'm going to cut. Okay, the onion. Now six carrots left. Mm -hmm. So that's our onion and oh yeah, onion. We've got two garlic cloves. I'm preparing the rest of us. Soon is still cutting the carrots. Yeah. There's soon gonna be five carrots left. Mm hmm. Five pieces is left because these were orig originally four carrots. Now, now the now there are four carrots. Mm -hmm. Starting with the fourth to cut. Okay. Do you need help? Are you you doing? I'm okay? doing well. Actually, okay. I'm doing them fast now. Perfect. I found a method to do it fast. Okay, so let's let's put it on a a cup or put it on a small plate. Yeah. Okay. Don't leave any gar carrots behind. Three okay, carrots so this to is cut. Our first. There's still more carrots. Okay, Three carrots. Okay. It's to be exact. So shall I start cutting the parsnips while you're still cutting carrots? Those are turnips. Oh, sorry. Why am I saying parsnips? Okay. You want it in small cubes? Uh, yes, I want small cubes. Okay. So we're both cutting. And, and okay, two so carrots for an egg. Okay, so this is the, the size of a, of a turnip cube. Uh, yeah, the two carrots left. Two carrots. Perfect. Okay. Uh. One carrot left. There are no more carrots. Okay, perfect. So I'm I shall. Start. Should I cut, start cutting the? Yeah, you can. You can look at me like, like I'm doing it. So cut it in a half first, then put it lying down. Okay. Yeah, let And then one, two, three. So you've got Lay four and down. Yeah, I think if you, if you put it this way, it'll be easier to cut. Then you I cut a that. piece off, so mm -hmm. now yeah. I cut the, the bottom. Mm -hmm. You're trying to have squares. Mm -hmm. I made small squares. Oh, that's fine. Whichever size square you want. Okay. 
I make smaller squares to the, towards the top mm -hmm. and make. So now this, I'm progressing with my turnips, progressing with turnips. So, 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 so. <laughs> Yeah, with different parts of the turnip, I cut them into different sizes. Okay. I think I'm too small, not to be that tiny. Yeah, towards the 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 the, the, the towards the more to the top the turnip slice is, the smaller the square will be. Like, I make these size squares okay. towards the top, which are smaller than others. Okay, mm -hmm. some goes in here. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's about not as hard to cut as carrots. Yeah. Do you notice the difference? They're softer. Navos, 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 Navos. So we're gonna put these in. I just, I just love the Spanish word for turnip Navos. I really just like it. The last pieces of turnips are being put in. Okay. Where am I going to put the garlic? Okay, wait a minute. <laughs> so we're going to use one fourth of the onion? Yeah, one fourth. So that means. That's one fourth of the onion. Okay. You can put this one back in now. Back in the fridge, please. Yes, yes. Now doing all the cuts in. You can also empty this to food recycling bin, please. Rinse it with water, that's where I'm going to put uh, onion and garlic. Oh. Okay. Okay, so we're going to, to put our onion and garlic into... Yes. Just remember not to make your eyes itchy with onion. Yeah, do not rub your eyes after you've cut. Onion. onion. First wash your hands. That's right, you haven't been doing... You haven't been doing... Uh, okay, so that's our onion and garlic. Now we, this is our... 
turnips. Turnip. And this, this is, is our, our carrot. carrot. So now what we're going to do, we're going to cut bacon into small pieces. Bacon. And this is nitrate free bacon. Yep. Because you don't want bacon with sodium nitrate, of course. Why, mm -hmm. why sodium nitrate is bad if people eat a lot of ham from just the standard supermarket without checking the ingredients. It is because of? Because it's carcinogenic. Ah, uh, yeah. People who don't want cancer do not eat bacon. Mm. Okay, I'm going do to not eat the regular bacon. But this is knife. good bacon because this doesn't have sodium nitrate. So what are the ingredients for this one? There's British or Irish pork, water, salt, salt, natural flavouring, as antioxidant ascorbic acid. Okay, they could have done without the ascorbic acid, but yeah, still not too bad. Yeah. If you need, if you definitely need bacon, definitely this is way better than sodium nitrate. And it's very hard to just go to a regular supermarket yeah. to find bacon or ham that wouldn't have sodium nitrate. Most yes. Of it have it. Yes. Okay. okay, so again we're cutting it into small pieces. Yeah. Maybe we should have lowered the camera to show how we're cutting it. So cut them into small pieces, like these, like this. Cut them into a piece like this. Okay. So again, I'm going to cut them together at the same time. <laughs> yeah, cut them. No. Could I help? No, because these are a bit tricky. I'm okay. I'm using a different knife. I'm trying to cutting, trying to cut it into small, small square yeah. pieces, such as this piece, <sighs> such as this, yeah. which is I, which is like this. Bacon a roux, bacon a roux, bacon a roux, cutting the bacon, bacon a roux, 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 bacon a Take this oh, through. the bacon is thin. The cutting is finished, and yeah. this is the bacon. That's See? Right. I'm also gonna wash mine. Ugh! Hot. Okay, so now what we need to do is get the. Okay, in this pot. Ready so to cook. Yep, we're going to use the, Ready the to cook. So what we need to do, we need to put the bacon Ready here. Okay. So, okay. cook the bacon for seven minutes. Okay, you can do that. Here you go. Yeah. And turn it on. 
So it says cook for seven minutes until it's crispy. Okay. Can you turn it on? Wait, wait, wait. Okay. How much? Yeah, you can put it on eight. Be yeah, there. eight. to do is we'll need to use this yeah okay just put it down once it starts heating up a bit more yeah and and as I said cook it until it's crispy cook it until it's crispy in a minute can we put it for nine and then once could you help yeah wait so this is the bacon, how it's cooking. Mm -hmm. It's not very fatty bacon, we can add a little bit of olive oil. Yeah. with bacon was kind of a traditional medieval soup as well, wasn't it? Yeah. We found one channel with a historical recipe, which was quite interesting. Yeah. Bacon's getting done. Yeah, I said until crispy. Yeah. Which says seven minutes. What? Slowly. Yeah. To the crispy bacon a roo. Yeah. Mm, I, can, I, I think I could put some the bacon. Yeah. My cat really likes bacon. Mm. Mm. She can smell it. Bacon a roo, bacon. Bacon's coming, apricot, that's right. <laughs> yes. Starting to look a bit crispy. Mm. And, when, and it says it's done when it's crispy. Can you smell the bacon? Yes. This is what's meowing. <laughs> it's the cat which is meowing. So? Yeah. And carry on stirring. We can see you. We can see you. We can see you. <laughs> Off she goes. Off she goes. Okay. <laughs> 
Okay. Hello. I know you want bacon. I know you want. Yeah. Now we're going to add our onion. Yes. I know what you want, Meowster. I know what you want. Yeah. Mm -hmm. to boil so we'll have the water for the soup ready and when are we gonna add the carrots now we're adding the carrots on the kettle is getting high mm -hmm. it's currently it currently is 90 degrees yeah and and the and it's and the water is finishing boil when it reaches 100 degrees and beware hot water very very hot yes yeah, that's like twice 
the temperature okay. in the Sahara Desert. Okay, so we're going to pour the, pour the water into our soup. Yeah. Right. You want to fill the half of the half of your pot. Yeah, it already kind of looks like a soup. I oh, know. And obviously we have to leave the carrots to cook first of all. But now we're going to add our salt. Salt. Okay. And we're going to also add a little bit of saffron. Okay. And when are we going to add the pepper? Yeah, in a minute. So that's our saffron. Yeah. It will help to colour the soup and make it a bit more orangey. Yeah. Saffron's also great as a tea. Yeah. So and our pepper. Okay. Yeah. So I'm putting the pepper. Good. It already is kind of looking like a soup. Yeah. And we're going to leave it to cook for about 10 minutes so the carrots are cooked and then we'll add our turnip. Okay? Yeah. So, in the meantime, we've lowered the heat okay. to six, and yeah. this is our soup. Yeah, so it's more of a simmering. Simmering, simmering. So now we're gonna put the soup turnips okay, in so the we're soup. We're adding the turnip. turnips. Okay. Mm -hmm. Put it on a very um, mm -hmm. low heat. Six. Okay. And just leave it for another ten minutes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Be like this. Okay. So now. The soup is ready to serve. Okay. Here we go. Yes. How much do you want? More? Um, just a bit more. Just. Okay. So that's our soup, and now we're going to shred some parmesan. Shred some parmesan. Shred some parmesan. Shred some parmesan. Oops. Is that good? Yeah, that's good. Okay. There it is. So here's the turnip soup. You're going to take a seat? Yes. And taste the soup. Now okay. we're ready to taste turnip soup. Or I like to call it soy fish nabos, nabos, nabos. What do you say? Needs Delicious. to cool down a little bit. Okay. Yeah, just my first spoon of this. So fast, nervous, 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 nervous. I've got some cheese there. Yeah, parmesan. Mmm. Yum yum. This is just... Is it tasty? Yeah. So should children give this a try? Yes. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. I think Grandma will be very happy that you're eating soups. <laughs> Well, I've already ate soup before no, no. and told her. No, no. But there's been a long period without any soups. Yeah, I know that. <clears throat> okay, well, bon appetit. Yeah. Hope you like. Hope you like. Give it a try. Let us yeah. know in your comments. 
and uh, do you all subscribe. All the likes and dislikes. So please put a like if you like this turnip recipe, and if you want other recipes and info about to stay healthy, please subscribe to our channel, Cook with Bastion. Bye 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 bye. Turnip sip sips. Yum yeah. Bye.